works out, but um, I mean, they're just as good as anyone else. It's, I mean, it's college football, so we take everyone seriously and all that, but it is kind of coincidental, so. How do you feel like Saturday went for you in your first action? Good, good. It was definitely a cool experience. First game in the shoe. Um, got the full experience. I mean, played a good, good amount of snaps, so it was just, it was just cool to get out there for the first time and just, you know, just play football, so. How do you feel the tight end unit did as a whole block on Saturday? Good. I really th think we did a great job. That's been a huge focus for us in the off season, spring ball, fall camp. So I think we're going to continue to get better at that and just show that we're a good uh, blocking unit. You guys ran a good number of two tight end looks. I mean, mm -hmm. what does that do for you guys to open things up a little bit to be able to run that kind of uh, offense? Yeah, we got, I mean, you guys all know we have a lot of weapons in the tight end room. So um, we just like to put that on display and then just um, different, different uh, opponents kind of play things differently against 12 personnel so that's just an area where we could kind of you know open up the playbook well do you think they built the schedule for you and with you in mind <laughs> I have no idea. Yeah. Opponents? I, I mean, know. You know what I mean is, is it, that is, it is funny how that worked out yeah. but uh probably not but um uh it is cool you know <laughs> just playing the same opponents I've been seeing in the past couple of years so it's, it's a good transition well, what is it what is it about Mac football football you think people don't know that need to know you understand what I'm saying? For oh, the yeah. competition level or whatever. I think it's just really gritty. I mean, you got a lot of players coming in and out of that conference, uh, given that it's a, like a lower lower uh, FBS kind of level. But I think there's tons of talent in there, and I think it's, there's just a lot of people that just want to play football. When did you know in, pre, in spring or uh, preseason camp that you weren't out of your element, meaning, you know, your first stop was at a Mac school, but now you're in Ohio right. State and stuff. When did you know that you had the goods, I guess? When did it become apparent to you? Uh, I mean, this spring ball was definitely a, uh, a huge transition for me personally. And um, it doesn't, I mean, we just focus a lot on the details and stuff like that. So, I mean, it doesn't really change the game. It's just how we kind of look at it differently here. And, I mean, just playing those max schools the same as any other opponent. So. Will Ryan, has Keenan helped you the most as a pass catcher? Um, just definitely my route running. Um, I think that's an area where um, I may have not received the most knowledge previously, but um, given the fact that he was a, a former receiver GA, he's got all the all the tools and tricks and uh, stuff like that. So he's definitely helped me in that area. He gave a lot of credit to your previous coach and for your right. foundation. How much did that set you up to, to have success early on? Here? Awesome. Yeah, uh, Coach Matt's a uh, tight end coach at OU, one of the best coaches I've ever had. I mean, he basically taught me how to play football at the next level. So all credit to him. Um, him and uh, Coach Key are pretty close. So um, just Key's ability to kind of just enhance that even more, like I said, given the fact that he was a, a receiver's coach. So. I think you, G, and Jelani played all right about the same amount of snaps. What was it like kind of rotating in and out, maybe not being in on, on mm -hmm. as many I think it's great. Um, we get a good rotation, keep our legs fresh. Um, we have different kind of packages, personnel for types of plays. So I think um, once we start getting uh, kind of a cycle down, it's going to be really beneficial for us. Did you grade out a champion? I did. Yeah. What does that mean to you? I mean, people ask about your yeah, transition here and all that. No, it means everything for the uh, for the program. I mean, that's what we strive for every day. That's constantly being pushed on us. So just the ability to take. The whole week of preparation and uh, put out on the field is just, I mean, that's huge for our program and just something we all strive for. Can you walk us through? You took the only tight end target or maybe one of two? Yep. Can you walk us through that play and, and uh, how you can come up with that you know, catch next time? Yeah. I mean, um, it was just a, it was a corner out. Um, I thought I gave a pretty good move. It was just, uh, just came down just the execution and just, uh, right timing and ball placement and just overall um, development of the play. So. Regardless of whether you catch your first target or not, is it kind of nice to have your first like the first ball thrown your way under your belt and now you can kind of move past that? You know I mean? Yeah, no, absolutely. I don't know if there's any nerves or anything involved. You've played a lot of football. But like, right. Now that that's in the rear view. I mean, there's, there's always nerves involved. Like, I mean, first game of the season, everyone's antsy to get out there and play an opponent. So, I mean, there's, there's always something there. But, I mean, I've, I've got thrown that ball millions of times, so. It's nothing, nothing different than what I've seen before. No. Yesterday, Ryan. Last two questions. 
Yesterday, Ryan uh, mentioned that there was a clip of you that was shown to the whole team of having a pancake block seven mm -hmm. yards down the field. Do, do you see yourself as a tone setter for blocking in both in the tight end room and on the team? Uh, yes, I do. I mean, uh, Coach Keen, the whole tight end room, that has been our message the entire year is just be his most physical, hardest playing unit. So, I mean, that's something that we do every day in practice. Like, you'll see it all the time during practice. And uh, so it's, there's nothing really different than what we do in practice and what we do in the game. So it's just, you know, just playing as hard as you can. Will you uh, bring a jet sweep in the bowl game? Have you tried to, have you talked to, to Chip about that, <laughs> to bringing that back here? Not yet, but I should. <laughs> <laughs> no, but uh, yeah, that was a pretty cool play, but I think um, I think he's got the play Colin Cotter. So. <laughs> All right, Will, thank you. Yeah.